Today, we'll talk about the top three concepts in large language models, namely tokens, vectors, and embeddings. So let's get started. As humans, we understand a piece of text by breaking it down into words. For computers, they break it down into tokens. Tokens are like words, but a bit different. In this example, each color segment represents a token. Tokens are important because it is the basic unit of how AI model operates. A vector is how the computer represents a token. Vectors are numerical representation of the tokens that give it meaning, so that machines can understand a word in the machine's perspective. But how do machines understand that the word apple refers to a fruit and not a company? This leads us to embeddings. Embeddings is a way to capture the semantic context or meaning of a token. They basically map the token into a space where the distance represents how related they are. That is, a car is not a horse, and a horse is an animal. The distance between the vectors give it meaning and context. Embeddings are multidimensional. In fact, GPT-3 has 768 dimensions, and newer versions of GPT-4 has thousands of dimensions. Because more dimensions means better understanding of our language, especially that our language has a lot of nuances. So LLMs operate by breaking input sentences into tokens, map it into their vector representations, and finally, embeddings capture the semantic meaning of tokens so that machine can understand the context of the sentence. Together, tokens, vectors, and embeddings form the basic building blocks of how machines understand context and meanings in large language models. But we are just scratching the surface. If you want to learn more, click on subscribe to keep learning.